according to the, the Bible, the God in whom I believe was one who, when he came among evil men, even allowed them to crucify him. So I've got to think again. And here I think it's parallel to science. It's no good my having preconceived ideas as to what the facts about God ought to be. If God has done anything to show them to us, to reveal them to us, I've got to sit down before those facts like a little child, to quote T. H. Huxley about science, uh, just as I have to sit down before the facts of the physical world or the psychological world, like a little child. Now, a smart child, mind you, we've got to try and think. It's not naivete that's wanted, but readiness to learn. Pin your eyes and ears open, so to speak, because unless God tells you these things, you'll never find them out. You can't find them out for yourself. Which eyes and ears? Hmm? Which eyes and ears is God speaking to, and, and show you through? That's a metaphor. Oh, yes. Psycho some psychologists understand <laughs> metaphor. Mr. Tracy.